hey gorgeous fam welcome back again to my channel it's a girl here from miss breezy and you're highly welcome to my channel if this is your first time stopping by on this channel thank you so much for clicking on this video please hit the red button that says subscribe if you have not subscribed and turn on the notification bell so that anytime i upload a new video you will be the first to be notified so guys here with me is my lovely husband and today's video we are going to be sharing the story of how I we met so many of you have been expecting this video but here we are today to 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 like give you the full gist of how the lovely lovely things they start yeah. <laughs> so guys uh she has said it all so my name is saint value if today is your first time of seeing me in this channel i'm the husband to this beautiful charming lady that took my heart away so today we'll be sharing how we made and stuff like that and i promise you guys you will enjoy it. stay tuned he is the one that is going to start the story because according to him the first day i entered the camp he was the one that collected things from according me according to me or according to you of course <laughs> you can't remember i hey, can't guys, remember let me take from here, let me take from here. It how was, will i remember was, i'm coming was... from another country with leg like you know there are many things on my head i think i'm not even seeing anybody i know they see road <laughs> i understand the struggle you went through like you were in the camp in Texas. then i saw one arab man bringing a girl into the camp and this arab guy is a very harsh guy this guy is very crazy and he's take all those kind of stupid stuff and we don't go close to him i don't know what happened to me what took me up from my chair and i went straight i went to her that was the first day I saw her where I've never met before. I, I walk up to her, then I took the bag she was holding, then I took her yeah, up to I the camp. Yeah, I was holding bag. So, that was the first day. We didn't see again. After some few days, I was sleeping outside. Some guys came to me and said that we saw a girl that looked like you. She's from Ishan. Yeah, people actually thought we were twins. I said, a girl that looks like me. My mind flashed back. Oh, a few days ago, I saw a girl that came. And really, those guys were saying that we have the same mark in, yeah, the, in the same side. That is the mark here. And we have it exactly in the, the same, same side. <laughs> so we never see again. After uh, we never see again, apart from the day I walk up to her, I took the bag from her and help her with her goals. That was the first and last day we saw in because particular. I don't come out inside she, the camp. Yeah, she don't normally come out. I'm so just after angry. some few few days they transfer us to another camp so that is when we met even where we, we were in the camp she don't come out apart from in the morning when she normally brush at the time i see them from there people will now recollect that ah man i wish they were related they, they are brothers and sisters this guy would have woke up to this girl when she was brushing and talked to her but we don't talk so when the now later took us to the next camp after we spent about few about a week or a yeah. few weeks there they now push everybody they now left us they said our connection man did not pay the arab men say our connection men did not pay them so they are not going to push us so they push every other people every other persons in the camp so they left us i was the only girl who was left and he was he and some other we were six in number yeah plus he you and seven. some other men yeah all of us were seven but i was the only girl yeah. so we were just in the camp and the thing hurt us though but that time i was so lonely because there was no guest for me there was no guest around for me to talk to like when i'm bored before i used to talk to people like we and the other guests that are inside the room together we normally talk geez laugh but when they push everybody away i was so lonely and all those other men that were there like i'm not too close to men like that they, before this incident happened he was trying to come close to me but i was trying to avoid him because i don't want anything like love 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 for that <laughs> in that kind of situation but after they pushed everybody and left me there i was so lonely i could not i could not avoid him anymore because he was the one that was coming to keep me company wait now come on oh, be so sorry fast. Sorry. <laughs> oh yeah, talk. She wanna speak it off. Let me explain. That particular night after they pushed those guys, it was remaining six boys and one girl. So she was sleeping all alone in the room where most girls normally slept. Yeah. So she was all there by herself sleeping. So we the other guys we were seven in number, we were sleeping. Something came to me. Why can't you go and secure this girl? Because you can't trust anybody in that kind of situation because i know we guys sometimes we can be crazy most guys can come there and rape her or arabo can come in 
and do all this kind of stupid stuff. So I just get up from my bed. So she was sleeping inside, although the, the, the room don't have a door. I was just outside, sitting down, looking at her while she was sleeping. I me, I, I, did, I didn't even know anything that. Know, after some days when I spent <laughs> I her, didn't know after, anything like we that we, happened. We don't, we don't talk. <laughs> because I was just sleepy. Yeah. We don't talk. We don't talk. So it was just, I don't know what happened. I just went there, sit down, she was sleeping. I was just looking at her. While I was doing that, I all those guys, they might walk into her room and rape her or stuff like that. So I don't know what said, just go prevent this girl from such things to have for uh, just go prevent this girl so that such thing will not happen so i went there and sat down she was sleeping i was looking at her because the room don't have a door it was in the morning a went, guardian angel yeah <laughs> so before they pushed before they pushed those guys i came to you and i try to talk to you you said you have a boyfriend your boyfriend is in italy <laughs> beside you pregnant for the guy I was just using and that to scare you away now. I, I, I <laughs> and you know that I was I had a lot of weights, although I was suffering, suffering and had the weights there. That 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 did not convince I was not convinced that you were pregnant because deep inside of me I knew if you were pregnant, I know the kind of symptoms that you'll be bringing up. Mm -hmm. Although you you are a lot of symptoms. Come on, man. You I you know. know the symptom of pregnant women. Hey, when you are a guy, when you are a guy, if a girl say you she's Ogacito. pregnant, even touching her palm, if guys may prove girls prove me wrong, there are some girls when you're pregnant, your the palm of your hand looks soft than any other. If any person touch it, they feel like man, this is something is wrong, or maybe this girl is pregnant. When I saw your 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 though you added weight. When you told me, I was I, I was not convinced, but the other man was saying it might be true. The other man said, This girl she's lying. And I was watching you closely. This girl, I was you know, I was very close to your friend Benedita. Yes, and it was Bennett that woke up to you. She was not telling me to give you a chance yeah. that you're a nice yeah. guy, blah blah blah. I said, hmm, I'm not ready. Upon he might, that, he, he, he I, might, I sent, I he, sent guys. <laughs> he might act innocent. I don't know why I, gave, I, I don't know why I went against my my dad rules before I left. My dad and my big brothers, Bota, they told me, hey guy, when you're in this route, don't 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 go close to girl. Even my uncle. Okay, <laughs> so rest in peace now. I don't know. My uncle said, don't look at any guys. <laughs> I don't so know. when you were telling me all those things that time, what my uncle told me before I, I left Nigeria, <laughs> day, can you remember the day we were inside that big room? You and some guys and some girls were sitting on the same side. Then when you saw me, you put your hand in my tummy. inside your tummy, <laughs> and I, I look at you. I shake my head. I say, "This girl, you don't know what's coming. Oh me, boy, you want to form all those things for me? For your mind. Come on, babe. Where are you right now? <laughs> when she put her hand inside her stuff. For my mind, what what are you trying to do? <laughs> you try to convince me that you're pregnant when you yourself know that you're not pregnant, or do I look like? No, seriously, I was trying to avoid anything concerning man in that room. My what my uncle told me was just keep the same ringing. thing. My dad told Still me still keep ringing in my ear. The when, face where you are when, going. When, when I was in so, the room, so I don't want to take any chances when of disobeying my uncle. When we are coming, <laughs> I don't know. You know what is yours is yours. You yeah. understand? Whatever that is yours will never pass you by. When I was coming, we were six in number, no burger. We just came to the road. We just we were we were friends. We just hey, go have fun. Let's travel. Let's go find life in the other side of the continent, which is Europe. Here. We left Nigeria. We were friends, six friends. But they don't have burger, and they they trunke him. Yeah. I made mention of trunke in my video. They trunke him. The guy, he knew the experience. The now guy, he know. The guy, the, uh, let me let me that one. That one is crazy. <laughs> the guy that even kidnapped me know my senior brother, which is NJ. Imagine. He said, he, the guy mentioned my name. Are you not innocent? Sister Gladys, uh, Gladys, younger brother. I said, yeah. He said, when they gave birth to me, when they were dedicating me in church, he, he took me, hold me. Imagine. I was thinking, this guy is going to, like, let oh man, let go. me go. <laughs> he said, but oh, that is yeah. not going to solve the problem. You go to call Control for money. Control money. <laughs> Eh, Libya, the more you eat, the more your money increases. Increase. Hmm. Back to what I was saying. When we were coming, we were six in number. Those guys, when we get to Duruku, Duruku is a is a place in before you you enter the what's Agades, the name before, before you head before Agades. It's a village. You understand? Our car, our 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 healers got spoiled there. Then the driver went back to Zidane to get an to get the engine for the for the Hilux. We were there. So we were seeing many people that were coming from different, different places that were coming from Libya. So they were saying that, hey, you guys are going to Libya. Libya is crazy. Even to cross the sea is very dangerous. And there are some lot of zodiacs there. If you don't have money to give, they will beat you up. They hmm. will pour you cold water. They hmm. will do this one. 
like it was better beating correct beating and the other guys i never knew their mind was shaking they were kind of carrying as in acting nothing's happening me myself i know that me i was scared of the road so one of these days the other guy came to me and said that bro we cannot make it to europe hmm. i don't know what happened i left there i can't remember the conversation anymore before the following day the five guys i didn't see them anymore hmm. and after three days the 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 connect the what is it called the driver came with the engine so they fixed it they said we should get into the car we need to go and i was calling the other guys it was desert it was echoing i was calling shouting calling their names nobody respond of which told me that i never knew those guys have gone back to nigeria and it was only me no burger nobody no friend if you know what you want you need to go for what you want you understand so when i was in the room so when, when how, how are you even sure that was the person you want how are you sure when you don't even know me before we don't even know each other before what attracted me to you your calmness oh she was kind <laughs> and she don't come back she don't mingle <laughs> she don't talk and within me i, I just i like this girl that this is, is very calm this is the kind of girl that i want <laughs> I must definitely get what I want before I back up. I don't quit. Easily. I wish I'd not allow you. What will you do? Uh-uh. When you know that you love me between you. <laughs> no. Seriously, I don't even love. I don't even, nothing like love at first. Mm. I wish they push us. Not, maybe me and you could have not even know each other. It was Since. God. Listen, it, God. Listen. God know how. God he, how. You know, you, God, have God know reason. how he can strategize everything. Mm -hmm. I wish, I wish the first time you pushed you deliver when i confirm tunisia yes i would have i would have I would known have. if someone like you exists exist. no and i wish the first time i took a trip to zuara you know I, I when i was we were in tripoli the first time we make a trip to zuara you see guys guy like me he would drive like he, he, he would dress like a girl do you dress like a girl no i did i have beards and they can't cover me and my eye is red how can the girl have a red eye <laughs> Do you know the first time that we travel to Zuara to, to push? Okay, you people travel. Before. The first time, yeah, they, they, they arrested us on the way. I spent two weeks in Zanzu. Mm. I spent two weeks. So yeah. I wish, I wish the. He spent two weeks in Zanzu. They were using them to pack dead bodies. Dead people. Dead people that they kid. Well, because if they arrest people and the people have stayed a long time there, nobody came to pay them, to out. Pay them out. They will just kill them because people. they have no because use to occupy the, the space. space. One of my guy Ken, he, 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 the guy we were in prison together, the guy took one dead guy, the, the body peeled. Oh. He took the hand, he, he took the leg, the leg peeled. Mm. It was it was it was God. And I wish I made that first trip. That first trip was successful. I would have met you. God have a way of doing the old God things. have a way of doing his things. And though. even the policeman that they sent to bail us out, the policeman truncate us. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was crazy like that, honey. <laughs> Thank God I not went through all those trunkey of a team, but I know what I still went through was not easy. But all those trunkey of a teens, I not go through all those ones. He was not caring and everything. I not considered him. I I decided to consider him as a friend, not as a dating partner. Not he do almost everything for me. He what any maybe if my cloth is dirty, I want to wash it. He say sit down, let me help you to wash it. Yeah. But I know in your, I know why you are doing that one <laughs> in your yeah. mind. You know what you <laughs> for me to get you. I I tried all my best. You understand i was really pissed off so i need to come up with another strategy you were pissed off what was in your mind since you were pissed off were you pissed off so you were you doing all those ones okay since this girl suffer me if i finally get her i will just chop her and go why would i do that we let, I was anything like that there ever? was nothing like that in my mind <laughs> okay thank god I, it was I, I, I when i saw her the first one i went to pick up the bar from her right from that day it was ringing my head and when people were saying they saw my sister this one this one it was all uh, from in my mind i was thinking is she really my sister of blood mm -hmm. i wouldn't let it avoid but when they they pushed everything happened we were all alone so, so we we're started not talking, getting to know ourselves know each other. we were fond of each other although there was no food to eat we were starving we are drinking still happy together drinking where water rust, uh, where water that, the, the way it's rocks thing is an iron and the water there was dirty and this little mosquito on top we still take up the mosquito and drink the water in order to survive after some few days i got a so sore throat this girl she's got she can be this girl she can be something next there's one thing that happened in the camp when some guys arab guys came to bust our camp we're eating we had some gunshot at the door 
I said, he's about to go there. He don't say it. Babe, how far? He said, she's hungry. <laughs> You're hungry. When we are here, going to shot. We will hear the gun shot at the door. Let's run. <laughs> she said she don't have power to run. Before she will run, she need to eat. It's to have power. I was thinking this girl, she's, she's, she was, she was like, I was joking. Joking. She was funny. Like, when we were talking, she get up. She went to the kitchen. She went to wash the plate. She was taking food. And when she was doing that, they were hitting the door. And I was, let's go. She said, I should leave her alone. One thing came to my mind, God, you need to run for your life. Leave her alone. If me to run then was not even in my mind. It was not in my mind to run because I might be running at the process they shoot my enemy. <laughs> so it's better I just sit down one place and let them come and shoot. I'm not that kind of person. I can <laughs> run. I can run for my life, man. So seriously, I not run, guys. I, I said, left her. Yeah, she he left me and I and he ran for his own life and I like the the step he took actually. But for me. I say okay, even even if I want to run, let me eat so that we have the strength to run. There is one thing that happened in camp one day be, if, before this one that you are saying that happened. There's a day we were eating and something like that was happening. You cannot cook. <laughs> Guys, you need to fight for your stomach. <laughs> we were eat we were we were we finished eating. So we, we have some provision once and maybe when are you we have finish? money. <laughs> okay, yeah, no, you we finish are eating. Finished. Maybe when you have money, you buy some stuff at the corner. So like maybe coke, when you're hungry, mineral, you just bread. take. We, were, we just finished eating. We heard some noise, like maybe they want to bust the camp. Everybody was running. Guy, I took coke. <laughs> listen. If I, you did listen, listen why I took You it. did not run alone. He took the coke I took the along. Coke along. Why? Because we don't know what is going to happen with the next day because there is no oh, food. Oh so you need to secure God. what you have. I need to, everybody was laughing at me. I said, come on, we can't leave this food. We cannot leave this food alone to get spoiled. Like, we don't I'll know where we're going. Remember, this is so funny. Like, that day, guys, after that thing happened, I laughed and laughed. <laughs> if I still remember about it today, I normally laugh because it was so funny. <laughs> they, they are busting the door. Okay, this mouth that I did now was eating. This one is more. Like, you were running, you can't cook along. <laughs> we don't know where we're going. It might be rocket there. No, you people run now. We run now. Yes, we, we, you we, people cannot, run. we cannot wait. You people now, many people run, but me and some other guests, we didn't run. We were inside the room waiting for them. Then to come. Ha, ah, my dear. Listen, when we just it's heard that, it's better we sit down we and move. wait because they were shooting guns. They were shooting guns. Anyhow, we went. We, you know, Arab is like Europe yesterday. They don't have zinc, like yes. they don't use zinc or those stuff. They, 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 uh, they concrete their roof. They use concrete on it. Yeah. They sent to Libya. So we, we find a way to climb the roof and the houses. They build it together. You can move from this house to this one on top okay. of the roof. Just be moving like playground. So we climb the roof. We are moving. We are running and. We were disturbing our footsteps, we were disturbing the landlord, the Arab men the that owns the house. The they bust out to the roof with guns, they were shooting. Hmm. They were shooting at dogs. Then, me, I was shouting everybody because to me, I love watching war film. I gained a lot of stuff from all those war films. So I knew that any bullet, straight bullet can kill you, but any bullet, if you sleep on the ground, a bullet come like this, it can't do you anything, it can just maybe enjoy you. Or maybe the bullet went up, if it comes down, it can enjoy you. I knew that for the movie that I'm watching. So I said, guys, let's sleep on the ground. So everybody slept on the ground. They were shooting, so the bullet couldn't get to us. If you see bullet, it was like, it was like, how will I say it now? It was like no card. When you see millions of people train yes, no card, you see the light at night. Gone. Hmm. Everybody now they slept shooting. on the ground. So when it saw that we how slept- How do you expect me to run like that? <laughs> when it saw we slept on the ground, the bullet has no effect on us. We don't have any effect on us anymore. They were moving closer. So when I saw they were moving closer, I said we should get up. We get up. So we moved to an extreme of the building. Hmm. Three story, two, two story building. Yeah, that was, it was two people story building. No place to go anymore. And some people, they went into some place. Inside where? Inside where, yeah. inside where the Arab maybe the Arab <laughs> people they knew that there are people inside this way because when Nigeria you can be crazy sometimes. How can you go inside they, where? What if you fall inside? Inside, inside the where they hide. What if you I don't know how they did it. The Arab men, you know what they did? They blow gun hmm. inside the web. Imagine you are inside <laughs> yeah. inside drum Jesus. and they cover the drum, just a little hole in the drum. You put a bullet on it. Ooh. How it sound crazy on the ear. Those guys, they said when they came out, their ear didn't work for two days. Hmm. So we on top of the roof now we have got it to an extreme, no place to go anymore. Two-story building. We have no choice. We jumped. Jump. 
we jumped down. When we jumped down, see, po policemen was taking up, was chasing us. Arsenal boys was chasing us. The the people that came to bust the camp, some of the people they were still chasing us with different cars. We don't. It was crazy, and there was street lights everywhere. They were seeing us. It was like my mind. What what is going on? This is how we go to end our life. We run for our life. No. After this happened, so they were not later taking us to took to prison now. They took us yeah, to they prison, took yeah. me. I said that before yeah. in my video. They took us to prison where the the driver and the policeman they were quarreling. Misunderstanding. They got misunderstanding. <laughs> like God was working. Yeah. You know, after they bust the camp, they took us to where we met and we were hustling for us. Like, you know, I was tired. I was sleeping. So they brought food. I was sleeping. I was tired. No, we are you sleeping? Or you were looking at me. You were shy. Not shy. I was, you know, I was, I, when I came, I was sleeping. I just relaxed. I was, no, I wasn't that deep in the sleep though. I was just kind of relaxing when they brought the hustle. So I was so tired to, you know, to hustle. So when they brought the stuff, <laughs> it was, you know, I was weak. I was relaxing. Yeah. You were sitting down with me. You were wearing all your Janavia, yellow, yeah. <laughs> yellow, green, and some colors like that. I saw someone that was sitting with me. Get up. If you see how this girl was hustling, was rushing <laughs> like <laughs> in a sack bag. Onza and the tomatoes. Me, I got I got up, then I took some. But her motivation was much. <laughs> Even me that was taking, I was I was surprised. I hold my hosa. I was looking at her. How she was taking the hosa. She said, you the look me. <laughs> I said, this is crazy. <laughs> like, like, because? Because, man, you don't have you don't have when it comes to food, you don't have I don't, like, I don't She said, me, I, when I saw her, because I have never, <laughs> up till now, I've never saw her in that kind of action. When she was, when 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 I woke up, I saw she was taking from it. Why everybody People was, came and it was, was they were rushing. They were rushing it. Hmm. And me, okay, I got up, I got up, said I was, It's I like, I take some. as money as you as can. can. If you don't still reach your hands, it's not their fault. So... You have to hustle for your food Seriously. because nobody will give you. You are a food hunter. Ha! Ah, nobody will give you bread. Come on, bread. <laughs> if you beg, <laughs> the kind of insult they will the throw you. they will give you, eh? Mm -hmm. The self will make you will make you not to be hungry again. It was the hunter that helped us. Hmm. The hunter that helped us, eh? That was one. We ate it for like two days now. Yeah, we ate before it Before the days. letter drove us out of the camp. Yeah, Abu Man just came. Oh. They select some guys. They just call names. They say you guys from side. We're thinking, oh, thank God, finally. They want to push. We are, we are pushing. They are pushing us. Don't I spent, I spent. Take us out of. Camp. I spent what about four mm -hmm. months in the camp. We, we suffered. We, we were four. We were four guys that that gathered out about two thousand people. They used us to start the camp before people were coming. They pushed before they can't. Means you blessing and that pray now to my yes. uh Kenneth and say you guys want to so we're happy they want to push. Push. We never knew you those guys they put us in uh, put us in one bad car like that in the, the in the trunk. So we were going. One of my friend Kenneth he said sent they want to go and dump box. I said, What are you saying? Before we knew they just packed into one they said everybody building. should but they were gone. Hmm. But they come down. I think like, man, this is life, man. We want to die. I even thought they want to kill us. Uh, yeah, that was my thinking I when I saw that. I thought they want man. to kill us. So after we came down, they entered the car, they left. Kind of said, it is finished. I remember that place where they dropped us, like middle of nowhere. No way. We don't, we don't middle come back. We don't nowhere. know any place. We don't know any place. We got to rush to the Shogo Grand because there's some normal day in Shogo Grand. You meet a lot of people, Nigeria, Ghana, Senegal. So we went there to make some call. We call our connection men. They said we said the girls they should wait there. We are coming. Mm -hmm. They should wait. We are coming. So we want to go and make some calls. We left them there. We went to the sugar ground. We went to call our connection man. I told them to follow me. <laughs> I was the one that lead them. I said yeah. if you like, you want to wait here, wait. But as for me, I'm not waiting here. I want to go and look for my way. The men have looked for their way. You never, you you, you never, yeah. You, you I said you, the men have looked for their you, way. Don't you know, wait. I told you you should wait. Yeah, you, you told said me. okay. You then I, said I left. Okay. When we came back after we called our connection man, they said, "Our, uh, you don't know what happened. The money is gone, so we should find how to sort ourselves out." So we said, "Okay, let's go back. When we get there, we couldn't find them anymore." We cannot, you can't, we can't, you can't, can't trust anybody. Can't anybody. Can't you can't trust anybody in that route. Even we are dating them, I can't trust you enough to like. Yeah. Uh -huh. I can't trust you enough because we are in the same journey together. All of us, we are hustling for, for our life. life. So I told the one when you people left, I told the girl, uh, the ladies there, if you like, wait for them. But as for me, I'm not waiting. I want to look for my way. 
so that is how we met and that is how the love thing started we are dating and me i was having my money in my hand so she the the she says she want to use one connection and she have already paid the money to the connection man and me i have my own money in my hand i don't want to use any connection because there are so many people that got yes i said i cannot so i can't wait when are we when are you pushing they said after ramadan I said me i cannot wait for after ramadan so i need to find any available connection then i saw one man he just came he said you want to do this one he said sure he's, he's cool he said yeah he's cool i said okay so i paid him out to his hand and i left and i never knew I was on the sea and she was on the sea with different boat, different yes, connections. We crossed the same day. We didn't know it was even the same, same day because <laughs> I left them in camp. So yeah. they took us to another place. That same day they came to pick him. So I he just told me that maybe if he'd not call me again, I should know that. I'm gone, man. I'm they Italian. have pushed. <laughs> so <laughs> we pushed the same day, which is on the 22, 22 of July. Yeah. 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 Yes. We push on the 22 of July 2015. Well, uh, meanwhile, if we are going, what we normally do is that we we'll write, we'll he will write number. number that I can call. So he gave me his mother number, he gave me his sister number. So I gave him my auntie number, I gave him my uncle number. <laughs> so anyone inside he can call just to ask for me. Mm. So when I later got to Italy, <coughs> I called my auntie and i told them i finally get to italy and i i think after a few days like after two days Marty called me that that my friend called that he have entered when i jumped up i was shouting happy like look for number to call him we're not talking well, that was how everything started yeah. and we will stay in Ita Italy there. We didn't meet when we were in Italy. I spent only one month in Italy before I left Italy to Spain. We didn't meet with that one month. I, I was not in Spain for three years. We are just still talking with no meet on phone before finally. Okay. that came to <laughs> before he now came he came to do something in spain yeah. something after doing the thing he got a job in spain so i think i said to him since you are now since you got a job in spain you are going nowhere, nowhere. hey that was how i truncated this man in spain before when i came you yeah. know <laughs> So guys, that is our story of how we met. I hope you enjoyed this story. If you have, if you watch this video up to this point, that means you enjoyed this story. Please, if you have not subscribed, subscribe to this channel and give this video a thumbs up. Please, if you if you enjoyed this story, let us know in the comment section. And thank okay? you very much for watching. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you all. And please check out his channel he has a youtube channel a growing yeah. channel please support his channel he he does a walking toy traveling vlogs and beach, vlog. and beach um vlog so please check out his channel i'm going to be leaving his channel link in the description box and i'm going to be pinning it as well subscribe to his channel and support our ministry support our growing family thank okay you much, guys. thank you very much guys we appreciate you all please if you have any video suggestion for us for us <laughs> Yeah. For us now, are you serious? For us now, you people should help me to tell him or to always come because he's working. He don't, yes. he don't normally have all the time because Thank you, you know. it's only weekend he don't go to work. But you people should help me beg him that weekend. He should, he should, he should please use it for more. My off day. Use it for so more. So which is more? My more. What is more? More now. You know the hair, bro. More. 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 more, more. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. We appreciate your support. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Bye. Thank you guys. <laughs>